Hey guys, before I start this vlog, I want to talk to those of you who are in New York. Would you like me to do a meetup before I leave? I only have about a week and a half before I move to Yale, so I was thinking of doing a meetup this Friday. So let me know on my Instagram, go to my Instagram and send me a message. And yeah, I hope I'll get to see you guys. Now on to the vlog. So I have been staying in my friend's apartment and they have a keyboard. On their keyboard, there is a harpsichord and a vibraphone function. So I thought it might be kind of fun to play around with it for this vlog. Earlier today, I was practicing Scarlatti's Sonata in D minor and I was at my other friend's apartment on the grand piano. So I thought it'd be kind of fun if I did a comparison and see which one you guys like better. Piano, harpsichord, or vibraphone. Here is the piano version that I did today at practice. On to the second version, harpsichord. Microphone. Fibrophone was so cute. I don't know which one I would pick. I think Fibrophone is cute, but historically speaking, obviously in Scarlatti's time, Harpsichord would be the accurate one. And I kind of had fun, felt like time traveling back in the day to play Scarlatti on Harpsichord. I don't know which one I would pick though. It's hard because on a Harpsichord, you can't do any dynamics. So you really can only show your expression through ornamentation, I think. I kind of enjoy having the ability to vary the touches on a piano, so let me know which one you like, piano, harpsichord, or vibraphone. I know I only played the first page for this comparison vlog, but let me know if you want me to record the full version of this Scarlatti Sonata. I had fun doing this vlog and messing around. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog also. Thanks for watching! And subscribe please so you can see more stuff and I'll see you guys soon. Let me know about the meetup in New York. Okay, bye!